What's up everybody? My name is Patrick, aka Dr. Blue, and this is a quick tour of my basement. Alright, walk down. Actually, we have our stairs here, and if you see the stairs, they're really shiny. I actually sanded the stairs down and put a couple coats on it to make it nice and shiny. Change the light. A little more modern touch. As you walk down, you come up to the theater room, which is my pride and joy. And then we walk into our theater room. As soon as you walk in, you kind of get an idea of why my nickname is Dr. Blue. I like everything blue. I have some blue lighting right here. The subwoofer for the theater system is hidden back here. And this is my theater room. I have surround speakers throughout the entire thing, center speaker. So there's, there's seven speakers in here for really, really good sound. And of course, I went with a projector and a 120 inch screen. My posters, Black Panther, love Black Panther. Walk out of the basement, got a really nice wide a uh, hallway. I really love this about the basement. Everything is just wide and spacious, so it's a lot of room. We'll probably turn this into a gallery. Still trying to decide what to put up on these walls. And then as you walk in, it is the open entertainment space. You also see my lighting again. Love the color blue. So everything just has a blue hue to it. I can't change the color. Um, it's called this the E-Lounge. So you got an official sign right here. So this is basically a bar, set up like a bar and lounge. Um, got tired of spending money at the lounge, so I said, you know what? Might as well build my own. So this is the bar here. Built it from scratch, of course. A tiling. And my actual bar, I mean, this this could pass for a legit bar. You know, got top shelf, middle shelf, lower shelf, got an ice maker over here. Um, a pretty small fridge that actually fits in the space really nicely. Um, got a microwave, it actually doubles as as a, a stove, so you can uh, basically uh, bake things in there also. The design in here, um, pretty cheap design, but it looks really good. Um, just taking um, some common wood, actually painted common wood, and just creating a nice design. I built this bar rack here just to kind of add a little wine collection to it, and the uh, wine rack right here. Snuck in a little sink right below the bar, just you know to add that touch, be able to wash some things out, and just ran the drain behind everything over here. Walk out, get a nice little seating right here for two. A little quick intimate space. Sectional. That fits the space pretty good. Other TVs over here. And have a pool table. Pool table with some benches. This actually doubles as a table. And the top of it is right there. So when we're not playing pool, this actually turns into seating for about 10 people, actually, which is pretty, pretty good. Walk back here is a hallway. See my giant signs right here. I'm a Giants fan, G-Man. And this is like my cave within a cave. So let's go in here. I like model airplanes, so I build some of those. That's what you see here. My space, of course, my blue light bar. A little piece of art. I also like building quadcopters, so this is kind of like my hobby room. 
where I can kind of come to get away. I have a whole gaming setup right here, flight simulator. Got the pedals, the gaming computer. Of course, got to represent for my Blue Phi. Remember Phi Beta Sigma? Another reason why I like Blue. And of course, I'm a diehard Giants fan. All right, so this is my cave, Florida State also. Oh, 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 go Seminoles. Another nice touch again, the Giants. Right, and this is the basement bedroom. Basement bedroom, of course, in case, you know, someone wants to spend the night. Um, so it serves as a guest room down here. Nice touch. Um, love light strips, so I built that also. Kind of... Um, Put the color of the room into it. We have a yellow and black theme in here, so the light is yellow. And this is just some simple decor in here, just to kind of make it look kind of good. Got a small TV on the wall, so you can still kind of, you know, watch TV, relax. Step right in the bedroom here, and it's the bathroom, which connects from the hallway and this bedroom right here. Of course, built and framed, tiled all this myself. Um, so didn't do a too horrible job. And then step back out into the hallway. And over here is actually um, built a little she cave for the wife also. So, you know, she didn't feel left out. All the lights are automatic. So this is her she cave. She designed it herself. She does a little um, creative stuff. She picked out her trimmings. Got a day bed over here. So, you know, she kind of hangs down here and does what she needs to do. Watch her shows and all that good stuff. And this is her sewing machine and everything is all in here. So it all pulls out. So I kind of hooked it up for her. So she had all the things she needed in here. And go ahead and step outside, actually. Again, this is an, a whole entertainment space, basically. So the outside, set up some lights out here. Looks really good at night. Um, got a heating lamp, of course, where if it gets cold, could still function out here. Um, got seating for, you know, it's three different tables set up out here. And the grill cover's off, because of course, you know, I have a smoker and a regular grill over here. I was actually grilling last night, so that's why the grill is open. And this is, this is my basement, a quick tour of my basement. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you like this video, please go ahead and hit that like button and go ahead and subscribe for more video. And I'll be sharing some tips on how you too can do it yourself and build your own basement. Bye guys.